Hey gang, Mocha Boy here. So uh, moving on to the last attack here. This was um, an attack on their number 11, another quad loon attack. Uh, what I want to point out about the the way that this this particular attack was done, uh, this was more. I would say this was definitely more of a brute force attack. There was uh, the way the air d defenses were placed. Um, we decided to, or rather, uh, San and Or, who, who attacked this base, decided to come in from from the southwest. Uh, you know, followed along by a number of uh, balloons behind him. But there was no lure, there was no lightning, uh, and, and he relied on the pups along with some heals and some rages to keep, uh, you know, to take out the, the clan castle as well as keep his balloons up. Uh, but the pups were res were responsible for taking out the CC as well as the AQ th that you'll see. And then it was up to the heroes to end up uh, cleaning up the base. So let's go ahead and watch that replay, and uh, I'll, I'll step you through it as as the attack starts. Now the first thing he did, which was really smart, was uh, to drop some barbarians in the corners to, to take out these builder huts. Uh, that did catch us a couple times this war, so we got a couple of 99% uh, attacks unfortunately, but hey, you know, it, it happens. Uh, so two, two hounds on that southern AD, two hounds on the other AD. Mind you, look at the way that he spread them out. He, uh, he, he did that specifically to, uh, to try to trip as many bombs as possible on the way in. Uh, followed along by, with um, a collection of balloons right behind them. And then uh, the rages go down to start powering them through, but also to, uh, to get those pups uh, supercharged so that they can take out whatever clan castle troops are left over. Now mind you, w one of the things that's happening here that you can't really see is that the CC is split up into two groups. There's one here, and then there's one here, but they're, right, they're standing right next to defenses. So as soon as those, uh, those balloons uh, drop bombs on those defenses, it takes out the uh, it takes out the clan castle troops along with them. And that's one of the things, like, if, if you can get your balloons into a nice cluster and then kind of follow along with the, you know, with the string of de defensive buildings, uh, you know, th there's a good chance, there's a good possibility that they'll be able to take the clan castle troops out along with any defenses that are shooting at them. Um, I mean, it is a, yes, there there's definitely some luck involved with uh, with getting that with doing that right and you know just like everybody else we're trying to figure out what bases are susceptible to this attack and, and which bases to stay away from but uh, we seem to be having more luck uh, than with this attack rather than you know against just a different variety of bases so that that's been pretty interesting and you know once that uh, that last balloon goes down the um, the heroes go into action along with the the pups I mean this was a nail biter I think this came down to the last second of this raid and uh, he, the the Archer Queen was finally able to get into there to uh, to snipe the town hall for the three. And yep, there go the pups. That air defense, of course, the one build, you know, the one defensive building that stays up is is the air defense. But uh, once the Barbarian King goes down, the Archer Queen gets in there, and three stars. Good stuff.